Members of the England team trained with a FIFA-selected group of about 20 migrant workers. They went on to sign autographs and gifted them tickets for their opening World Cup match against Iran on Monday. The plight of migrant workers in building the infrastructure to host the Football World Cup in Qatar has been one of the key issues in the build-up to the Games. France players, including star forwards Kylian Mbappe and Karim Benzema, trained in Doha as the start of their FIFA World Cup title defence draws ever closer. They will begin their Group D campaign against Australia on Tuesday before matches against Denmark and Tunisia. The last nation to successfully defend their World Cup crown was Brazil in 1962. Brazil trained in their camp base in Turin in Italy. The five-time world champion will travel to Qatar on Saturday. Brazil starts their group at journey against Serbia before taking on Switzerland and then Cameroon. This is the first World Cup being organised in the Middle East in 20 years since Brazil last won football's greatest prize. The Japanese team arrived in Doha ahead of their first match against 2014 winners Germany on Wednesday. They also have games against Costa Rica and 2010 champion Spain. Japan has never reached the quarterfinals at the World Cup. Qatar is getting ready to welcome football fans from all over the world as they descend on the ultra-conservative country. While bars are few and far in between, the ones that have gotten the license to sell alcohol are saying fans won't be disappointed. What we want for people to know is, come, you're coming for to the FIFA, you're coming for the biggest event of the year in the world, and it's amazing. And Doha has done us proud, really proud. You will not be disappointed. They will not be disappointed, I tell you. They just need to relax and enjoy. That's it.